exercise 10.2 the first sum the question is find the derivatives of the following functions the given function this algebraic function this is a trigonometry function both are separate functions only no problem so i need to differentiate f of x differentiate is f dash of x f of x differentiate is f dash of x x differentiate is 1 i have told you previous self minus 3 is a constant sin x differentiate is cos x this is the first sum next if we are going to move towards the second sum the second sum is y is equal to sin x plus cos x because I teach you many things detailly. So differentiate of y is y dash otherwise you can write dy by dx also no problem. Differentiate of sin x is cos x plus cos x differentiate is minus sin x. If x differentiate is 1 only if I go into multiply also no problem the same answer remains. So cos x plus into minus minus sin x. Next third sum f of x is equal to f of x is equal to x into sin x now we have got f of x is equal to x into sin x this is going to be u this is going to be v we know the formula d by dx of uv is equal to u v dash plus v u dash keep one differentiate this one plus keep this one and differentiate this one f of x differentiate is f dash of x keep x as it is differentiate of sin x is cos x plus keep sin x as it is x differentiate is 1 so answer is going to be x cos x plus sin x x cos x plus sin x next the fourth sum y is equal to cos x minus 2 tan x differentiate of y is y dash otherwise you can say dy by dx also no problem cos x differentiate is minus sin x minus minus 2 is constant tan x differentiate is secant square x therefore minus sin x minus 2 secant square x next the fifth sum g of t you see this is f of x they are in x variable function is in the x variable x variable g of t this is a function g of t is in t variable g of t is nothing but t cube into cos t therefore t cube is algebra 1 algebra cos t is trigonometry so this one i am going to take it as u this one i am going to take it as v so g of t you can write g dash of t g dash of t g of t you can write g dash of t first keep t cube as it is cos t differentiate is minus sin t t differentiate is 1 if 1 i am going to put or not going to put no problem because 1 multiply the same remains same answer plus write cos t as it is cos t, t cube you know the formula nx power of n minus 1 bring the power 3t Residue power uh, 3 t 3 minus 1 is 2 that's all so you can take the answer minus t cube sin t plus 3 t square cos t 3 t square cos t very easy sum no minus t cube sin t plus 3 t square cos t sixth sum differentiate of g is nothing but g dash of t 4 right as it is secondary differentiate is nothing but secant t tan t secant t tan t plus tan t difference nothing but secant square t if you want you can take right now what is common here secant t is common take secant t outside 4 tan t plus secant t otherwise you can stop answer here also next is seventh sum y is equal to e power x sin x this is a product rule i have teach you while taking the introduction itself this is going to be u this is going to be v y differentiate is you can say y dash or you can say dy by dx First, I keep e power x as it is. Differentiate of sin x is cos x plus. Now, keep sin x as it is. e power x differentiate is e power x. So, take e power x outside cos x plus sin x. The main thing I need to teach you, if he knows differentiate only, you can write this sum. Otherwise, you can't able to solve this sum. Next, eighth sum. Eighth sum is y is equal to tan x divided by x tan x divided by x this is called divided rule no d by dx u by v you can write as v u dash minus u v dash by v square this is going to be u this is going to be about v so y differentiate is y dash otherwise dy by dx and the first write v as it is v is nothing but x u dash differentiate of u differentiate of u nothing but tan x tan x differentiate is secant square x minus u write u as it is tan x Dif v dash differentiate of x is nothing but 1 
v square nothing but x square so what is our answer is going to be x secant square x minus tan x divide by x square next ninth sum the same model y is equal to sin x divide by 1 plus cos x the same this is u this is v y differentiate is y dash otherwise you can say dy by dx first you write what is the formula v write v as it is 1 plus cos x u dash differentiate sin x u is nothing but sin x no differentiate of u dash sin x differentiate is cos x minus u write sin x as it is v dash differentiate of 1 plus cos x 1 differentiate is 0 cos x differentiate is minus sin x you want to write carefully v dash differentiate of v u dash minus u v dash no u right u sin x v dash 1 differentiate is 0 plus this 1 is constant no 1 differentiate of constant is 0 is plus only but cos x differentiate is minus sin x put minus sin x divided by v square 1 plus cos x the whole square so we need we need to write cos x into 1 cos x into 1 is nothing but cos x cos x into cos x nothing but cos square x 0 so minus into minus plus sin x into sin x nothing but sin square x divided by 1 plus cos x the whole square this is cos square x plus sin square x nothing but 1 1 plus cos x divided by 1 plus cos x the whole square this one and this one cancel so remains nothing but 1 by 1 plus cos x is the required answer for this sum so the same divide and rule x divided by sin x plus cos x this is going to be u this is going to be v formula you know the formula d by dx u by v is nothing but v u dash minus u v dash by v square y differentiate is y dash otherwise you can write dy by dx first you write v as it is what is v here sin x plus cos x write v as it is u dash differentiate of x is nothing but 1 minus right u x v dash differentiate this one sin x differentiate is cos x cos x differentiate is minus sin x divided by v square sin x plus cos x the whole square sin x minus cos x the whole square next this is must you need to know differentiate sin x plus cos x minus x cos x minus into minus plus x sin x minus x sin x how are we going to take listen this is sin x this is x sin x what is common here sin x you can take outside so it remains sin x you moved outside 1 plus x the same this one and this one what is common here cos x common so 1 minus x this is 1 minus x divided oh i forgot divided here so i put here sin x plus cos x the whole square the same here also sin x plus cos x the whole square this is a required answer next we move towards the 11th sum 11th sum is y is equal to tan x minus 1 divided by secant x so 11th sum this is going to be u this is going to be v y differentiate is y dash otherwise you can say dy by dx first you need to write v write secant x as it is differentiate of u dash u dash is differentiate u tan x differentiate is secant square x minus 1 constant differentiate is 0 minus write u as it is tan x minus 1 differentiate of secant x differentiate of secant x nothing but secant x tan x divided by v square nothing but secant square x now multiply this is going to be our secant cube x 0 is missed tan x if you are going to multiply this minus no minus secant x tan square x tan x into tan x tan square x minus into minus plus 1 into multiply becomes secant x tan x divided by secant square x in this both i am going to take secant x common secant x secant x and going to take this becomes secant square x secant square x minus tan square x plus secant x tan x divided by secant square x you know secant square minus tan square x 
secant square x minus tan square x so answer is 1 one of the trigonometric identity so secant x into 1 is nothing but secant x plus secant x tan x divided by secant square x I can take secant x outside secant x outside nothing but 1 plus tan x divided by secant square x both will be cancelled only secant x remain 1 plus tan x divided by secant x I can separate 1 divided by secant x plus tan x divided by secant x this tan x I, am, I can write as tan x by cos x divided by secant x ok 1 by secant x I can write as cos x sin x divided by cos x secant x I can write as 1 by cos x cos x cos x cancel the last answer is cos x plus sin x y is equal to sin x divided by x square d by dx u by v is equal to v u dash minus u v dash by v square this is u this is v y dash is equal to dy by dx is equal to keep v as it is x square differentiate of sin x is cos x minus right sin x as it is differentiate of x square is 2x bring down the power and reduce the power by 1 2x divided by x square x square the whole square so what is the remains answer is going to be nothing but x square cos x minus 2x sin x divided by x power 4 because this is x square the whole square will be x power 4 here x square x you can take x outside if you are going to take x outside x cos x minus 2 sin x divided by x power 4 both will be cancelled so remaining is nothing but x cube therefore x cos x minus 2 sin x x cos x minus 2 sin x now sum number 13 13 is nothing but y is equal to tan theta open the bracket sin theta plus cos theta sin theta plus cos theta you can do this sum in u itself how this one take it as u this one you take it as v so you know formula d by dx uv is nothing but u v dash plus v u dash keep u and differentiate v dash plus keep v differentiate u dash y differentiate is y dash y dy by dx also first write u as it is tan theta v dash sin theta differentiate is cos theta cos theta differentiate is minus sin theta plus sin theta differentiate is cos theta you can't put x here sorry you can you can put theta because y with respect to theta no so d theta okay you need to put theta only y with respect to theta so d theta tan theta k as it is sin theta is nothing but cos theta cos theta is minus sin theta plus now keep sin theta cos theta as it is sin theta plus cos theta tan theta differentiates nothing but secant square theta tan theta differentiates nothing but secant square theta so this tan theta I am going to write sin theta by cos theta open the bracket cos theta minus sin theta plus this secant square theta I am going to write 1 by cos square theta open the bracket sin theta plus cos theta now I can multiply things so multiply with this one sin theta into cos theta both will be cancelled remain sin theta alone sin theta into sin theta sin square theta divided by cos theta listen carefully sin theta into cos theta cos theta cos theta cancel remain sin theta alone minus sin into sin sin square theta divided by cos theta plus the same procedure I can use here also sin theta divided by cos square theta ok plus cos divided by cos square becomes 1 by cos theta so this is sin theta right sin theta as it is this is denoted cos theta it also denoted cos theta how I can write plus 1 put 1 cos theta as it is 1 minus sin square theta plus this one sin divided by cos theta into 1 by cos theta because cos square no cos into cos cos square divided by sin theta sin theta plus you know 1 minus sin square it's nothing but cos square theta divide by cos theta plus sin by cos theta is tan theta 1 by cos theta is secant theta 
if cos square cos cancel the remaining acid is nothing but sin theta plus cos theta plus tan theta into secant theta this is a required answer sum number 14 cosecant x cortex so keep this u and v y dash dy by dx right cosecant x as it is cosecant x definition of cortex differentiate of cortex is nothing but minus cosecant square x plus right cortex as it is differentiate of cosecant x nothing but minus cosecant x cortex cortex if you study formula only you can able to know this formula once again saying right cosecant x as it is differentiate of cortex nothing but minus cosecant square x plus right cortex as it is differentiate of cosecant x nothing but minus cosecant x cortex so it becomes cosecant x into cosecant x becomes minus cosecant cube x next plus into minus minus plus into minus nothing but minus this is cosecant x cosecant x cot into cot cot square x so take minus outside this cosecant cube x i can write <coughs> cosecant cube x i can write as 1 by sin cube x minus cosecant x i can write as 1 by sin x cot square x i can write as cot square x by sin square x you can understand i think so cosecant i can write as 1 by sin cosecant i can write as 1 by sin cot i can write as cos by sin if you going to see lcm is going to be same sin cube x sin cube x so i can put only one sin cube x close the bracket 1 minus 1 minus 1 into cos square x 1 minus cos square x this a minus will not come sorry minus i moved out say no so it becomes plus so this is a required answer for this sum next i am going to move towards the 15th sum see here y is equal to x sin x cos x you should not sir this is x this is sin x this is cos x you we what i want to do this one you don't need to write i told you keep x differentiate to the same y dash differentiate is y dash otherwise dy by dx listen carefully students keep uh, x and sin x as it is x and sin x as it is differentiate of cos x is minus sin x plus i have kept x and sin x as it is differentiate of cos x minus sin x now after this i differentiate cos x now i am going to keep x and cos x as it is x and cos x as it is differentiate of sin x nothing but cos x next the last one what is the last one keep sin x and cos x as it is x differentiate is 1 i think you can understand first x and sin x as it is cos cos x differentiate is minus sin x i differentiate cos x here i differentiate sin x here i differentiate x here i am going to differentiate cos x means x and sin x as right as it is if i am going to differentiate sin x x and cos x right as it is if i am going to differentiate x sin x and cos x right as it is so this is the required one so now see this is x sin x and sin x minus x sin square x this one plus x cos square x this one is plus sin x cos x so what is common here x is common so take x outside x is common put first write this one cos square x minus sin square x cos square x minus sin x is moved outside no plus sin x cos x next is sum number 16 so y is equal to e power minus x log x keep this one as u this one is v y differentiates y dash nothing but dy by dx first write e power minus x as it is log x differentiate log differentiate x log x differentiate is 1 by x this is a formula log x differentiate 1 by x plus now write log x as it is log x now e power x differentiate is e power x e power minus x differentiate is e power minus x but you need to see minus x minus x is nothing but minus 1 x differentiate is 1 so you need to write minus 1 what is common here e power minus x is common take it outside e power minus x e power minus x e power x minus minus side nothing but 1 by x minus plus into minus minus log x therefore e power minus x 1 by x minus log x so seven in sum one of the typical sum i think so they given once again three parts so
so first one y differentiate is y dash otherwise you can say dy by dx also you need to differentiate properly first i am going to differentiate e power minus 3x so write this first this one x square plus 5 log 1 plus x now differentiate e power minus 3x you know differentiate of e power x is e power x differentiate of e power minus 3x e power minus 3x but minus 3x in differentiate minus 3x in the bit minus 3 x differentiate is 1 x minus 3 x differentiate is 1 plus next now x square plus i am going to differentiate this one so put x square plus 5 and e power minus 3x as it is log x differentiate is 1 by x log 1 plus x differentiate is 1 by 1 plus x that's all log x log x differentiate is 1 by x log 1 plus x differentiate 1 by 1 plus x that's all simply it's over next plus now write this both and differentiate this one log 1 plus x e power minus 3x differentiate x square plus y first differentiate x square bring down the power 2x power 1 5 differentiate is 0 constant differentiate is 0 no so i written this one so totally what is common check it e power minus 3x e power minus 3x e power minus 3x so put e power minus 3x outside e power minus 3x outside this one is going to be minus 3 minus 3 x square plus 5 log 1 plus x next plus e power minus 3x move outside x square plus 5 divided by 1 plus x square by 5 divided by 1 plus x e power minus 3x move outside so 2x remains so 2x log 1 plus x 2x log 1 plus x so we have finished the sum next the sum is 18 sum number 18 y is equal to sin x degree this degree we can't able to differentiate so this x degree i need to convert into radian you know how to convert in radian which you studied in the trigonometry therefore x degree to convert into radian i need to multiply pi divided by 180 so that it will convert into radian pi into x is pi x divided by 180 radian so this degree is converted into radian so right now y is equal to sin what is x degree pi by 180 into x y differentiate is y dash otherwise dy by dx first differentiate of sin you know sin differentiates cos so write cos pi by 180 into x very very important sin differentiate is cos cos pi by 180 into x sin differentiates over this is constant pi by 180 is a constant right pi by 180 x differentiate is 1 if you want to teach you in another way listen d by dx for example you take sin 2x what is sin differentiate cos cos 2x next i need to differentiate 2x right 2 x differentiate is 1 the same cos pi by 180x sin differentiate is cos pi 180 by x next right this is a constant pi by 180 is a constant x differentiate is 1 so what is the answer is going to be pi divide by 180 pi divide by 180 cos pi by 180 into x okay you can able to understand i think so next the last sum 19th sum y is equal to log x base 10 this is one of the problematic sum this base 10 we should not do we can't able to differentiate so y is equal to that should be nothing base should be present so what i can do i can do simply log e base 10 into log x because log actually log e is nothing but 1 log e is nothing but 1 this log e only i am writing in form of such a way that how see if 10 moves here log this 10 come log 10 log x base 10 log e only just added this one of the formula type this one of the formula but i not any formula i written the straight answer log e base 10 into log x if x if anything for example here there is y is present i can put log y here. there is no right here so now differentiation this is only a constant one this is a constant log e base 10 is a constant y differentiate is y dash so write log e base 10 because a constant no 
log x differentiate is 1 by x that's all log is different 1 by x so final answer is going to be log e base 10 divided by x so last sum of this exercise sum number 20 they given f of x i need to draw a function f dash of x that's all so you can you will define f dash of x f of x differential is f dash of x 2 2 is a constant bring on the power down 2x power 1 minus 5 x differentiate is 1 3 differentiate is 0 ok so 2 2 sir 4 x this is minus 5 this is f dash of x now I am going to draw the line for this sum so still I do not have any scale here better I will draw in free hand but you should draw using scale if you have graph please attach otherwise using scale draw properly x y x dash y dash so first plot the point so x and f dash of x first I am going to take x value is 0 and 1 and 2 this is enough this 3 points enough if x is 0 4 into 0 0 this is going to be a minus 5 if x is going to be 1 4 into 1 is 4 4 minus 5 is minus 1 if x is going to be 2, 4 2s are 8, 8 minus 5 is 3. So, this point is enough for us. So, this is going to be 1, 2, 3. This is minus 1, minus 2. 1, 2, 3, 4. Minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, and minus 5. First two point 0, comma, minus 5. So, it comes here. 0 comma minus 5 1 comma minus 1 1 comma 1 comma minus 1 comes here 1 comma minus 1 0 comma minus 5 2 comma 3 this is 2 this is our going to be 3 2 comma 3 now join this point if we going to join this point this comes as a straight line ok straight line this is a point nothing but f dash of x this is a line f dash of x is equal to 4x minus 3. So, from this we are finishing this exercise. The main thing I need to tell you in this exercise, I have derived this exercise very easily. 20 sums I have derived very fastly. Why I derive fastly? Because I teach you the interaction very depth, depth way. Without telling the formula alone, I not told formula alone. I have told formula, I given many examples for each and every formula, how to derive, how to make a derivation. So only, so only I done the uh, exercises very fastly. Uh, so that if you are going to study the formula very easily, then these 20 sums, not only 20 sums, back to back exercises are going to be very, very easy for you. So study all the formulas properly and understand the three videos in the introduction very easily and you can, so that you can solve the sums of all the exercises in this chapter. Thank you.